Hey everyone, here's a look at Aerochrome Infrared LUTs Pack. Revolutionize your imagery instantly and get real IR effects and looks that stun your audience. Aerochrome is like having 11 IR lens filters in your camera bag for the price of one. Powerful tool in every creative's toolkit. Transforming your footage and photography with stunning infrared looks has never been easier. From natural to vibrant, these LUTs provide you with great optionality no matter the medium. Each infrared LUT has a slightly different amount of tone, tint, and saturation, allowing you complete customization of the perfect IR effect. This pack is compatible with all major photo editing software except for Capture One. Unfortunately, C1 does not support LUTs at this point in time. We hope they will update their software to support traditional LUTs in the near future. With that said, I'm going to walk you through how easy it is to make a real infrared photo effect using our infrared LUT pack and I'll show you some tips on how to unlock bonus IR looks when you combine different color LUTs together. Let's drop in. As always, if you're new here, consider subscribing to join the community. Leave a like, it helps us out big time with the YouTube algorithm, and comment below what you would like to see next. Let's get started. When you download and unzip Aerochrome, you're gonna get 11 dot cube files, and these are your LUTs. And so these are super easy to install into Photoshop. What you wanna do is just go over to your applications, go to the latest version of your Photoshop, click presets folder, and your 3D LUTs right here. You can basically just copy and paste these directly into this folder along with all your other dot cube files and LUTs that you have uh, that come standard with Photoshop. So I've done that already. I've just simply copied and pasted them into this folder. And let's pull up a photo in Photoshop and show you how easy it is to get some stunning infrared effects. So what you wanna do is you'll have your basic imagery. You wanna to go to adjustments. You wanna do click your color lookup. That will pull up your properties and then this is basically in an adjustment layer and you go 3D LUT file that you want to load and you just click on infrared LUT 1. And there you go. That's how easy it is to really revolutionize your imagery and transform it and make it stunning. What I like to do just typically to get kind of an overview look and to check out each LUT and then basically pick my favorite one. So that's LUT 1. What I'll do is I'll just do this 10 more times and I'll add each LUT. And then here we go. Now basically within your photo and in, in the PSD file, you can easily just scan through each look and figure out what look you want. You can also combine two of these to really kind of unlock some other cool infrared effects. So if you combine LUT 1 and LUT 11, you're gonna get this incredible bright purple that is super dynamic, really captures your eye. You can also combine 1 and 10 together, which gives you this really dark blue right here. You're also gonna kind of get some yellow hues that pop through, or you can combine 1 and 9 and this will give you a bright orange. So super cool, easy, and intuitive to use this LUT pack in Photoshop and really give your photo that infrared photo effect. So have fun with this. We highly recommend checking out our Prisma, Prisma Effects and Abstract Lens Effects template. It's the ultimate Prism Effect toolkit for unique kaleidoscope and diopter effects with drag and drop ease. Prism Effects is like having 30 lens filters in your camera bag for the price of one. Drag and drop your video clips or image into ready-made sequences with pre-designed abstract lens effects and export to any video software. Thanks so much for watching. As always, if you're new here, consider subscribing to join the community. Leave a like, it helps us out big time with the YouTube algorithm and comment below what you would like to see next. And we'll catch you in the next one.